Cells are the fundamental building blocks of all living organisms, a marvel of nature that encompasses a vast array of complex processes, each intricately woven into the fabric of life. Imagine a bustling city with numerous activities happening simultaneously. This is akin to the cell, a microcosm of life, teeming with molecular machinery and biochemical reactions. At the heart of every cell lies the nucleus, the command center, housing the genetic blueprint in the form of DNA. This DNA is not merely a static repository of information, it's a dynamic entity, constantly being read and transcribed into RNA, a process known as transcription. The RNA, particularly messenger RNA, mRNA, then travels out of the nucleus into the cytoplasm, where it serves as a template for protein synthesis. This process, called translation, occurs on ribosomes, the cellular structures that function as the site of protein synthesis. Here, tRNA molecules bring amino acids, the building blocks of proteins, to the ribosome, where they are added to a growing polypeptide chain in the sequence dictated by the mRNA template. The synthesis of proteins, the workhorses of the cell, is a key aspect of cellular function, as these proteins go on to perform a myriad of functions, from catalyzing metabolic reactions as enzymes to maintaining structural integrity as part of the cytoskeleton. Beyond the nucleus and ribosomes, the cell is home to various other organelles, each with a distinct role. The mitochondria, often referred to as the powerhouses of the cell, are where ATP, the energy currency of the cell, is produced through a process known as cellular respiration. This intricate process involves the breakdown of glucose and other nutrients, releasing energy that is then captured and stored in ATP molecules. In plant cells, chloroplasts perform a similar fundamental function, but through photosynthesis, converting sunlight into chemical energy stored in glucose, a process that not only fuels the plant cell, but also produces oxygen, a byproduct vital for life on Earth. The endoplasmic reticulum, ER, is another critical organelle existing in two forms, rough ER, studded with ribosomes, and smooth ER, which lacks ribosomes. The rough ER is primarily involved in the synthesis and folding of proteins destined for secretion or for incorporation into cell membranes. The smooth ER, on the other hand, is associated with lipid synthesis and detoxification processes. Close to the ER, the Golgi apparatus functions as a cellular post office, modifying, sorting and packaging proteins and lipids before they are sent to their final destinations, either within or outside the cell. Cells also maintain a dynamic relationship with their environment. The cell membrane, a phospholipid bilayer interspersed with proteins, acts as a selective barrier, controlling the movement of substances into and out of the cell. This membrane supports various transport mechanisms, such as passive transport, where substances move along their concentration gradient, and active transport, requiring energy input to move substances against their gradient. Endocytosis and exocytosis are other vital processes, allowing cells to intake large molecules or particles and to secrete substances respectively. Communication is vital in multicellular organisms, and cells communicate through signaling pathways. These pathways often begin with the binding of a signaling molecule, a ligand, to a receptor on the cell surface. This binding triggers a cascade of intracellular events, leading to a cellular response. These signaling pathways are critical in regulating various processes, from cell growth and division to apoptosis, the programmed cell death crucial for maintaining cellular homeostasis and preventing diseases like cancer.